In California, it was nice to see some snow as well. This is live copter three looking off toward the Sierra. Right now we're over Amador County, not too far from Plymouth near the where the Cosumnes River is. And as you look up the hill, there is some new snow up there. We did get some nice snow last night. The higher elevations 10 inches or so, and we did get some snow down to about 3000 feet, kind of a dusting there. So for so for some areas, it was the first snow of the season. Let's hope there is more in the future. Right now, we still have some clouds in the valley, but they are clearing. The temperature now 54, and we will have mainly clear skies throughout the night. We are going to be looking at the chance of some fog developing during the overnight, but this forecast takes you through midnight, and it doesn't look as though we'll have any fog by that time, but maybe by 4, 5, 6 o'clock tomorrow morning, we could once again have some fog in the valley. The rainfall totals for the last 24 hours, not bad. For areas like Sacramento, Stockton, and Modesto, it was in the range of about a half an inch, and then you get into the foothills, and most areas were over an inch. Auburn had 1.2, Placerville about 1.1, Jackson about 1.5, and these are just representative of the area. I looked for places like Grass Valley, as well as Georgetown and Columbia. They're all in this same range, about 1.2 to 1.3 inches in the foothills. So a nice rain. Right now, however, we are drying out. That weather system is beginning to move on out, and behind it, we will have mainly clear skies. I'm going to skip all the way ahead to the day on Friday and look ahead to our next chance of rain. So this is Friday morning. Once again, probably some fog in the valley, giving way to mostly sunny to partly cloudy skies. We had had a chance of a shower in the forecast for Friday. We had reduced that down to a chance of a sprinkle. Now we've just taken that rain out of the forecast. Friday's going to be a dry day. You can see a few clouds going by, but that's about it. So let's get into the day Saturday. This is Saturday morning at 630. We start with increasing clouds and then this next area of rain will come our way for the valley. We're not looking at much maybe one or two tenths of an inch of rain that'll go through in the middle part of the day. It's one of those things that'll just kind of zip on by. But for the Sierra, it will be more significant. Once again, we're going to see some pretty good snow. Let me give you the preliminary looks of what we're looking at in terms of snow in the Sierra. And again, this is during the day on Saturday for the higher elevations, 10 to 14 inches of snow. And once again, maybe four to six inches of snow down to 4000 feet with some snow down to 3500 feet. Keep in mind, traveling through the Sierra on Saturday will get Get back to chain controls. So if you saw any of the pictures of the travel in the Sierra last night, just keep that in mind. Chain controls, slow travel on Saturday, but for the valley, not much. So tomorrow we have some fog, a few clouds Friday. Saturday is when the valley gets only a little bit of rain. And then we are dry probably until next Wednesday. Beyond that, we have another chance. But the, the main uh, focus of the forecast right now is Saturday travel in the Sierra. Okay. Avoid it if you can. Go Friday early if you can. Until now. Or go Sunday. Okay. Or Thursday. <laughs> <laughs> All right.